welcome back to MBE. Uh, today I want to show you our MBE Big 9 package. Um, this is a casting that Brodex makes for us. Um, when we get these, they're blobs. We put all the seat bores, guide bores, spring seats, pretty much everything. All the CNC porting <clears throat> is done in-house. And we do that just to police everything. Um, so everything is perfect for the end user. So, you know, we'll just start with the manifold. We do cast manifolds for these. Um, we also do sheet metal. Um, but here is the, uh, the sheet metals are done by either HRE or Hogan. And the cast ones we do in-house. So this is a, and the cast ones, all this is dictated by cubic inch and RPM. So the size of the runners and the size of the plenum volume, um, all that is dictated by what the customer is doing. So not every manifold is created equal. Okay, so that's what specializes this, so it works for your combination. A 565 is going to be a different manifold than a 632. An uh, engine that runs 7,000 RPM is going to be a different one that, go, that, that runs 7,800 RPM, and so on, or 83, or whatever it is. So, and then we come over here to the cylinder heads. I want to show you the, the, the three different chambers, chamber uh, options we have. We have the normal one, we consider this just, you know, with, with the high quench areas. Um, so this would be mainly be for normally aspirated stuff. Then we have the light nitrous. If you're going to put like a three or 300 shot on it or 400 shot, then we have the conical chambers that we do for it. Which these are common, I'm sure most of you have seen these. And then we have our anti-deto chamber, which is anti-detonation. So this gets rid of all the quench. You know, probably looks more like a diesel or something. But um, this is just to get rid of the detonation and get the chamber volume larger for the uh, bigger cubic inch. It doesn't change the flow coefficient at all. It just helps with uh, getting rid of the detonation. Okay, so when you order the you know, order the heads from us, we we do we can do complete assemblies. Um, we suggest it for most customers, but you don't have to do it if you don't want to. That's fine. Um, when you do get the stuff from us, um, you know we use a. We use a valve with three angles on it. These are CRN coded. That's a victory valve right there. Um, we run lash caps, so we suggest running lash caps and everything, not steel tips. Um, and then, on, so th here's an exhaust valve, and uh, this would be for a nitrous application. And the reason why it is, if you look from here to here, and you see all that taper goes out. Um, that's has a we, we call that a we call that a hub that is a two degree hu two degree hub and it adds mass to this so as the heat grows especially on a nitrous engine um, the valve won't bend because it has more mass in this area to dissipate to keep the valve straight so everything is specialized that we do here so this valve is for the high nitrous engine okay the other ones will not have that hub on it to keep the weight down and then and then we will help pick out a spring for it you let us know. What RPM you run, we'll suggest what push rod that you put in it, if, if need be, if, if, if you want that. Um, we will suggest what spring you put in. Um, we can assemble them here, or you can assemble them. Um, but when we do all of this, we help you with the spring choice to make sure you have the correct one. And we will also let you know how far to install it from coil bind. Um, things of the past, we used to always assemble, put springs on from pressure. Uh, we don't do that. Um, that is a thing of the past. I would say probably most of our competitors still do it that way. Um, but we've been fortunate to be able to educate ourselves with the, with the people at PSI, the engineers at PSI. So now these springs are put in, are, are dictated by how far from coil bind we go in. This particular spring is 130 thousandths from bind that this will be installed at. Um, and every spring is different. Um, but we're privy to that information from PSI. And uh, so it just makes makes it easier for the end user where the heads after a season they come back they'll look like new so this this package also comes with we do this in uh, Moroso makes these valve covers for us um, these are these can come with or without spring oilers for the nines you just run your dash four line to here usually off your oil pump or something oil filter and then uh, and then it has squirters here. That's that. Oh, that has squirters here in the valve covers. There's fine, minute holes in here that you really that you can't see because of the black anodizing. 
um, and what it does is it helps keep the, the spring cool, uh, the springs cool. So it'll it'll squirt oil on here and here, and that does help uh, your life. If you're eighth mile racing, probably not very important. Uh, truck pullers, absolutely important. The most the most important is the truck puller, but um, super comp, super gop, super comp, super gas, anything quarter mile, yeah, it's going to help. It's going to help for sure. And it's, I think it's a $150 option for the, for the oiler, so it's not very, it's not very great. Um, I can't give you any prices because it depends on what options you get. Um, as you can see, we use either Molestar or real A25 copper brilliant seats. We do not use the brass ones. You can tell the brass by the color. I would say 90% of our competitors use the brass because they're cheap. Um, when looking at our products, everyone complains. Oh, you're $850 more than the competitor. That is all in seat material. That is all it is, I promise you, that's all it is. So we do not offer that material because it's ignorant to put it in because it does not save the end user money after one season. So, but this is the uh, MBE Big Nine package, 600 CFM, 360, over 360 on the exhaust. Uh, like I said, we have versions for normally aspirated power adder, it's hard to give a package price just from a video because of the different options that these come with. Steel rockers, aluminum rockers, gesso rockers, T&D rockers, the different springs, titanium locks, all of that are dictated by the price, what manifold you use, sheet metal or cast, the valve covers, things of that nature. But if you call or email us, we have no problem sending you a quote, but it's easier to go, go over the quote over the phone to find out exactly what you need to make sure we get everything right in the quote for you. It's not an estimate, it is a quote. Um, this package right here, this time of year, this is a week and a half to two weeks out. Um, we always have castings, heads are in inventory, we keep valve covers in inventory for this and manifolds. It's, a, it's always been a hot seller since we brought it out a couple years ago. Um, this is certainly the replacement for all the 12 degree Big Duke, all of the 11 degree Big Chief stuff. This stuff is so much better. And with, with some of the other videos that you watch, the one-piece rocker system, you know, 23 fasteners holding the bar on, makes the valve train more stable, all that's built into the head. That doesn't cost any extra for the end user. This is the MBE Big Nine. Thanks for watching.